What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Pizza Maker 8000. Now, today I want to show you the most OP demigod small forward build. Now, this is my build that I play on. I have like five or six different builds, but this is my main build, and I've been working on him more than anybody because this build is just unstoppable. So, for the skill breakdown, you're going to choose this one where it's playmaking for about 75% of the pie chart. Once you select that, you're going to select the first one for your uh, physical profile. Now, when you set your potential, you're going to max out your playmaking off rip. Max out the playmaking. And then max out the three-point shooting. Once you do that, you're going to go up and you're going to max out your standing dunk, your driving dunk, and your driving layup. Come down here, put my steel up just a little bit, lateral quickness, perimeter defense. All need to be maxed. Then you have extra points, so I usually do the close. I'm going to do the close shot. That's what I did on my play, and I'm going to put the rest to my post hook because I ain't doing no goddamn post hook on a small forward. So as you can see, I have 30 playmaking badges. 15 shooting, 12 finishing, and 1 defensive. So, 30 playmaking badges is a lot. So, this is going to be a playmaking sharp, is what you think it is. But for some reason, 2K does not call it a playmaking sharp, okay? Then we're going to go to 6-5. Now, I know you're thinking, small forward, why the hell am I making a small forward 6-5? Look at that speed, man. A 95 speed with a 93 acceleration. With a standing 3-point shot of 75. But that's not even fully done because, look. We bumped down his weight, 95 acceleration, man. That is ridiculous. And we put his arms all the way down. You go up to a 78 three-point shot, man, with a mid-range of 82. And also, you get 15 shooting badges, so you can get catch and shoot on gold. You can get, you know, difficult shots, all that shit. So you can become kind of a dirty-ass player. Now, this build is a playmaking slasher. That's what it says. So for my takeover, I have the playmaking, but you can do the slashing or the shot crate or even the post score, whatever you want to do. I have the playmaking so people can't know. So people don't know I can shoot. Because if I had it as a shot creator, they're like, he's a playmaker slasher, but he has, he has a shot creating takeover, he might be able to shoot. That way, I'm standing on the wing, they're like, oh, he's a playmaker slasher. He's not knocking that bitch down, and I knock that motherfucker down. You hear me? So, you can see, like I said, a slashing playmaker. And I don't know why the hell they compare him to Kawhi Leonard, because I only have one defensive badge. But this is my build for NBA 2K20. This is going to be my main build. 